Pokemon Radical Red, but I can only use Frog Pokemon. Is this possible? I don't know. Let's just try. There are truly no rules beyond I can only use Frog Pokemon. Past that, I don't even know what's going on in this game. So let's just find out together. <laughs> this game is made by... Soup, Ursel, and Koala4. Okay, if you paid for this in any way, you got scammed. <laughs> Alright, well. And you want to play Radical Red? Don't ask me! Just look up how to play Radical Red and then don't pay someone. It's all here. Don't ask me. I will not be answering that because I had to look up the same question you had, I had myself. <laughs> New paths will open to you by helping people in need, overcoming challenges and solving mysteries. Or frog, they forgot that. At times you'll be challenged by others and attacked by wild creatures. Be brave and keep pushing on. I certainly will not be brave, but that's fine. Through your adventure, we hope that you will interact with all sorts of people and achieve personal growth. That is our biggest objective. I just want to play with frog Pokemon. I don't... I was going to be the one who made this into a bigger thing for no reason. But the game is trying to get me to achieve personal growth. I bought a Supreme Frog shirt. What, like, what else do you want from me, Radical Red? What? You know what? Let's just keep going. This is a lot. I'm, giving a, uh, I'm putting a lot on my plate, if we're going to be honest. Uh-huh. That's not a frog, but that's fine. Sure. You study Pokemon as a profession. That's pretty cool. I will tell you a bit about myself. Am I a frog or am I a frog? I'm a frog. Okay. Well, that's uh, pretty simple if we're going to be honest. A little... Uh, frog man. Uh, it seems to be the, the correct name. Yes. My grandson. Who is the rival of Frogman? Now, if you guys are not aware. We accept one Marvel hero in this household, and it's Marvel's Frogman. Now, I don't know who the enemy of Marvel's Frogman is, but I'm sure that's the actual enemy of who we're going to be going against. So if anyone would like to tell me, or even lie, I don't care. We just need a rival. Okay, we just need a rival. Not Toad, no. We accept Toads. Toads are our frog friends. No, no, no. In this family, we love both frogs and Toads. We are not saying no to frogs and Toads. Uh, you want to bring up like salamanders and other friends that are, are somewhat similar. Not the same. They're not included, but we still love them. Okay, we need something that's against it. The walrus? No way. The walrus? Come on. Is it really the walrus? That's that's incredible. Oh, that's incredible. I chat, you could be lying. I don't care. We're making it canon. Our our enemy's the walrus. No, that doesn't that doesn't matter to me. I'm I, hey. Want to know what else was made up? Chet. The Chet family was made up on the spot. So you know what? You guys say walrus, I say bet. Let's do it. The walrus is the, the natural predator to frogs everywhere. Everyone know this. Children know this. It's elementary. I can't put the... Should it be wall rust like wall Russell Westbrook like Russ? Like or just Russ? Or maybe do we put a period? We put a period to show how menacing. It's a very serious walrus. Nothing after, just walrus. Yep. There it is. Hey, you better remember. Uh-huh. Sure. I think there's some rules we have to go through, so let's see what's going on. I did a four-page report in third grade about the battles between walrus and frogs. I mean, you went to a good school. Please stop mashing in properly answer the incoming questions. Oh, oh, thank you, game. I was going to do that. I Hot take. This is already one of the better ROM hacks I've ever played because they, they see me. They understand that I want to go and play the game. They're like, hey, buddy, you're going to ruin this. Just you read, man. Just read. Um. No, I would like. Ooh. 
Minimal grinding mode? Uh, yeah? Yes. Oh my god, yeah. Yes! I don't want to EV train. I would like to... I want to attempt to entertain people. I want to at least try to entertain people. EV training is the least entertaining thing possible. That's what you do when you're bored and you have like a TV show on the background and you can spend hours getting the perfect EVs. This is not for content the creation. Oh my God, yes, thank you. Ah. 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 It's not that I'm a coward, it's that I want the frogs to reach ultimate glory, and we don't wanna, we don't wanna limit the frogs, because there are only a few frogs. We can get Bulbasaur, we can get Poliwag to get Poliwrath and Politoed, we can get Krogunk, we can get Seismitoad, and we can get Greninja after beating Misty, I think, for a second time. That's a minimal amount of frogs. We will not have many frogs, we won't even have that many typings. We are going to get obliterated by certain Pokemon. Hardcore mode would probably make this impossible. What are these noises? They're the noises of someone who loves frogs, okay? I'm just, just, let me be. What was restricted mode on? I'm gonna say no. Um. Okay. Huh. No, I'm not going to turn on easy mode. I'm not a coward. I'm just not brave. I'm not super brave and I'm not a coward. No, I'm not putting on easy mode. No. No, I want to get my frogs. No. No. There's a lot of questions. That's fine. Favorite flavor of frog? I... <laughs> I... Uh... <laughs> Chat, if you guys start talking about eating frogs again, I'm gonna I'm gonna get really upset. I'm, I will be distraught. I'm I will be really upset. I'm gonna be honest. Choose any starter so you can catch the first frog. Well, we're gonna start with a frog. Don't uh, don't overthink this. Uh huh. Can I speed up? Oh, you can speed up the ROM hack. You can zoom. Oh, this is amazing. Cool. Hey you. Okay, cool. He's at the lab? Sweet. Hey, man, what's going on? I I guess it actually is the beginning of the game. I thought they might have changed it. It's okay, Oak. I got frogs to catch, Oak. I got frogs. Come on. Ah. Uh, you silly man. <gasps> yes. Chat, this is a big moment. Right there, it's the only choice. Bulbasaur is a toad. I will even go and look it up because some people get a little upset and a little confused of what's going on with Bulbasaur. They're like, Bulbasaur? Is that a frog? And they use that voice. I don't understand why. But yeah, no, if I if I go to the uh huh. If I go to the origin, Bulbasaur is based on a frog! According to Ken Sugimori. Don't want to butcher any other names. The latter designed Bulbasaur working backward from Venusaur, meaning Bulbasaur was the last of its evolutionary family to have been designed and also directly based on Venusaur. In particular, its build and ears resemble Beald Sibafu, a large prehistoric frog. This frog. And now with that out of the way, we continue forward with the knowledge that this is not just a frog, but it is our first frog, and it will be the most special frog, as it will carry us from the game from start to finish. Prehistoric frog, dino frog. We could name this dino frog. That that might be a little too simple, but hey. Frogosaur, frogosaur. Rob Frogkowski. That is too long, but honestly, could be up there. We can't go Chet. That's a shiny thing. I think Frogosaur is the move. 
I think Frogosaur is amazing. Play the Frogger ain't to ancient music. Oh, that might be a good move. That might be a good call, Katie. Let me see. I'm typing Frogger to ancient. Yeah. <laughs> Not only is this our first frog, it comes with a theme song. The prehistoric frog, Frogosaur. This, this is what you live for right here. <laughs> this is the peak. <laughs> oh, please tell me I spelt this right. I, I will never live it down if I spelt this wrong. And that is just... <laughs> Very true. Frogosaurus Rex don't have don't have the characters for that, but Frogosaur will never let me down. Yeah, Walrus. You can do anything you want. We have a theme going on here. What are you gonna do? Huh? We got a battle now? Yeah, let's see, Walrus. Let's see, huh? You have a lizard? You have a fire-breathing lizard? You think my prehistoric frog is scared? of your regular lizard with fire uh, on its tail maybe fire in its heart huh you know what frogosaur eh, you got this i don't care about any of the things you're saying all that matters to me is getting this first victory and setting the world on fire with our performance huh scratch don't like that i feel like this charmander is hurting my feelings we do have potions. Am I allowed to use potions? Okay. Right. I I don't want to accidentally use that too early. So we can use items in battle. Some people said you weren't able to do that. That was probably the hardcore mode. Again, not a coward, just not super brave. It's different. Charmander can't have a berry. Charmander, Charmander is allergic to berries. Right? I, I think that's true. It is true. And here it begins. The dominance of frog Pokemon. Radical Red stands no chance. There we go. Rival Walrus out of here. Frogosaur. The dominant starter. And now it's time to really set this world ablaze. We'll save that special music for when it makes sense. But until then, we keep going. All right, chat, let's keep it moving. Do I have to talk to Oak or to go do the thing? I think I have to go do the thing. All right, we can run immediately, which is very exciting. But the first frog we can catch is Route 25, 10%, or Cerulean City Old Rod. So it's just gonna be us and Frogosaur for a little bit. Now, if anyone here has experience with Radical Red and wants to throw any knowledge at me so that I'm not being a big old dumb idiot in terms of getting frogs quickly, I'd be really happy with you. I Maybe I'd even call you a... Uh, I don't know. Do we, do we have a fun name for people who love frogs or friends of frogs? We can figure it out. We can come up with... We can come up with frog lingo. Galarian Zigzagoon's here. Huh. Can I do frog music throughout? I, I like to save the frog music for big moments, right? Because if I use it too much, I take away from the power that is the frog or two soundtrack. Right? So you don't want to overuse it. You still want... You still want to get hyped every time you hear Frogosaurus theme. I mean, it's... I was really overwhelmed. Oh God, I did have workouts today. This hurts so much. Why am I doing this, John? You stupid idiot. Why, why are you, why are you doing this? This is so, you're not even adding much comedic value. You're, you're just, this is, oh God, this is hell. 
Oh, geez. Oh, boy. I'm back. Okay. Okay. I, I don't know what happened there. That was so weird. Whoa. Break the frog. You pulled a jack there? I... Uh, no, I just, I, I created a, a, a fun time to open, fro let's find a frog. Come on, Hack, you need to give me a frog here. Come on. Uh, what the hell is this? Hydreigon. We got Hydreigon. Uh, sure. What, what is this? <laughs> hey, look at this. This is sick. Okay. I actually love that card. This is cool. What is a... Smiger? What? Like, is it a Smeagol Tiger? Lord of the Rings Tiger crossover. Okay, pretty white card. Rosemary, sure. And then another pretty card. It's not a frog. Oh, and then there's another card. Oh, crab! Hey, crab! Look at that. All right, well, that's fine. That's fine. We didn't find a frog, but everyone is still proud of us. Right? Everyone is still proud of us. So you know what, chat? We're going to keep on moving, and nobody is going to talk about the fact that we've already whited out. Because, chat, if we bring that up, people might say that frogs aren't that powerful. Or they might just say mean things about me. Maybe they'll call me ugly because I lost. I don't know. They call my, uh, Mikey bald, but that's also just because he's hiding how bald he truly is under a hat all the time. It's a tough scene. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> Are feeling it now, Mr. Frog? I'm feeling a lot of pressure to lead the frogs to victory, if we're going to be honest. You lost to an acorn. I lost to a, a sentient acorn, okay? It had thoughts and feelings and emotions. I, I don't know what to tell you. Danish is deathly afraid of frogs. So to be fair, I don't think he's really a traitor. It's just he is living proof that frogs are really powerful. He's a grown man scared of frogs. And you know what? I think that just means frogs are superior in all ways. They're just very, very powerful creatures. You know, I respect him. I respect him for understanding the might that uh, frogs in general have. You know, you see a poison dart frog, you know, hopping about. You don't want to be in that way, uh, little, little critter's way. Poison dart frog you. He'll get out a dart gun and start hitting you with darts. That's terrifying. Can you imagine just strolling around the Amazon uh, rainforest, as most people do when they're off days, and a frog is just shooting darts at you? That's awful. Do I have a pet frog? I don't have a pet frog. A lot of people are trying to get me to get a pet frog, but like... The genuine answer I have to why I will not get a pet frog is I love frogs too much to get a frog on like a because of a meme. I don't have the time to take care of multiple animals. And like, I don't want to get a pet and like not take care of it properly. So I, I'm not going to be getting a frog off of a, a meme. No, why should we be proud? I don't even know what's going on. Oh, no. Um, all right, let's go back to Oak. Let's go see what's going on with uh, Mr. Old Man. Cool, thank you, Oak. There we go. That's pretty sweet. We got Pokeballs. I have no frogs to catch here, so I need to get past this area very quickly. Frog, I need you all healed up. Actually, does this tell me anything? I see S. Is that like to show that this is on like the minimal mode Ooh, minus special attack is actually kind of frustrating it's adamant right adamant nature i mean this is a physical move of course and i think razor leaf is physical too but i should be aware of that okay all right that's fine what pets do i have i have ginger and that is my pet she is adorable i love her dearly ginger is an honorary frog Maybe we'll get Ginger a a uh, frog costume. Uh, maybe we'll just do that. I mean, chat. I, I'm not saying I'm gonna like jump off the deep end into like frog crazy town, but I already have. So I just like I get excited for the ride or or, or worry deeply. I it's honestly up to you. It really depends on your thoughts 
on purchasing a frog shirt that is a poorly drawn frog that is saying that he knows Supreme. If that if that purchase worries you, or if you're all in on the purchase, it really kind of shows what side of this uh, adventure you're going to be a part of. I, for one, love it very much so. Make Ginger a mod. Ginger's taking a baby nap. That's what she's doing. The frog does know Supreme. What the heck? Who are you? What? Oh my god! That is so cool! What do you mean? Whoa. I'm talking to everybody. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? They they just do this? What? What do you do? Sure. Okay, wh what's in this grass? Hey, Meryl. You're not a frog, but I'll beat you up. Are there level caps? I don't... I have no idea. Magical leaf. Perfect. I mean, obviously, it's a special move, but, like... It's pretty exciting. You can also just buy eggs. That's kind of exciting. Huh. Carolan. Uh, I'm I'm pretty sure that's yeah, you did that, Carolan. You you just get it. I appreciate you. <laughs> chat, I'm gonna let you in on a secret, right? I feel like it's only fair. Now, chat, as you may or may not know, I've started a merch line. Uh, seventh merch, right? You know, okeymen7.merchforall.com. And the goal of the merch is to create something that I'm excited to wear myself and hopefully. Other people will not just want to buy to support me, but also want to buy because they think it's cool and want to wear it themselves. If you don't like the designs, that's completely fine, but I didn't want it tied to me, tied to Pokemon, tied to a Poketuber. But the designs we have there, that is truly just the beginning. I want to do different drops, different ideas. And right now I'm working on a limited design that is going to be similar to what we have there, but frog inf infused. I've contacted an artist. It is being worked on. Hang tight and wait. I'm very excited. Yes! I am wise! Thank you! Fro Frogosaur! It's an old wise frog. One of the uh, one of the elder frogs in the Pokemon Kingdom. It boosts special moves, which our frog friend needs. It needs a boost on the special side with its minus special attack nature. This is perfect. I do. Does that matter? I no. I know how that works. John has a Dynamax brain like Jack. I don't. I don't think I like people saying that because I thought people usually just threw that out just to goof on Jack. Now I'm not saying that you know people should goof on Jack and not goof on me, but I'd appreciate that. <laughs> It'd make me feel better. <laughs> Right? Just don't, you know, don't, uh, don't make fun of the, the size of, don't, just don't, don't call me, you know, Gigantamax head. That, that might hurt my feelings now. People might be like, uh, John, you say it to Jack, isn't that hypocritical? Yeah, yeah, it is. I'm fine with it. Give me the old rod early. Why not? Oh, no way. Yes! We got this immediately? Oh my God. Whoa. We immediately got the old rod. Let's check out the bag. Okay, town map, yeah. So we can get Poliwag at Route 25 or Cerulean. I don't know, uh, I, for some reason I thought we might get to Route 25 before Cerulean. Unless it's, no, it's not below Palatown. Where is Route 25? Where is Route 25? Above Cerulean? Am I dumb? Don't answer. There it is. Okay, it's fine. Ah, it's fine. I figured it out. We figured it out. Let's let's just go over here and see what's going on. Route 22. There are no frogs here, but there's a sand shrew. The sand shrew scares me. Deerling doesn't scare me as much. Did Deerling just have Sap Sipper? I kind of feel like that's bullying, if we're going to be honest. But let's go and... 
train up a little bit before we go against Gary, because I do want to go against uh, not Gary Walrus. I wanna I wanna go against the Walrus. Okay, let's just take you out. Cool. What level do I want to get to before we go against Walrus, do we think? Why are there a Lolan Pokemon? Because this game is sick. Uh, well, what, what else do you need to know? Why is the rival a Walrus? Because Walruses are the natural predators to, to frogs, is what I was told. And Frogman, Marvel's own Frogman. So, that's how, it, that's how we go. Is this modded or vanilla? This is Pokemon Radical Red. I have as much knowledge on Radical Red as anyone in the chat. So unfortunately, I'm not gonna be able to answer any of these questions, like at all. But you guys can talk with, you know, within the chat and ask each other questions about Radical Red. I've never watched anyone play the game. I've never played the game. I like to save like ROM hacks to play for the first time on stream, just so that my reactions are more fun and, you know, we kind of see what goes on. I think it's fun that way. Do you generally like the color red? Oh, I guess so. I mean, like, I mean, I like the color combination of red and black a lot. I know that probably wasn't a serious question, but I felt compelled to answer it. I gotta be honest, my first thought was questioning, with relating the color back to how many shoes I had of that color. So I feel like my brain is possibly broken and I need to get outside more often, if we're gonna be honest. <laughs> is this a Nuzlocke? No, heavens no. I'm not gonna let my... Is that a Megastone? <gasps> we can get Mega Venusaur! Ooh, that's exciting. Ooh, that is really exciting, chat. Okay. Cool. Mega Venusaur is gonna be incredible. Wait, where is that Rapscallion Walrus? There's a Megastone over here I must investigate. It might be Mega Venusaur. I need you out of the way. Walrus. I know you have a Starly, but I have Leech Seed, and I will... Take the life out of the Starly one turn at a time. You can see the wise glasses on my face. You didn't need to use Frisk for that. You horrible, horrible bird. That's fine. Do whatever you got to do, Starly. And we're going to take a little bit of health out of you. Magical Leaf is going to do more than we would expect because of my wise glasses. Ooh, okay. This thing's just growling. It's scared, it's a cowardly bird. Encourage the cowardly bird. Ooh, one turn, just don't do the thing. You did the thing. You did the thing. We were so close to you not doing the thing. This is because I didn't have the theme song on. That's on me. That's on me. Nope. I accept the responsibility of what I've, what I've done. That's okay. We need the Frogosaur theme song on. That's that's my bad. Everything will turn around now. I see the Charmander. I understand the Charmander. I can hear the Charmander. The Charmander is a crook. It's a criminal. Don't don't trust this Charmander. Uh, one iota. Nope. Nope. Uh, nope, just, it's, nope. Just, nope. This is where everything turns around. We leech seed the Charmander. We're going to get more Charmander nutrients to grow big and strong, okay? There it is. Are we stalling with potions? Yes. Is it a cowardly strategy? Possibly. But it doesn't matter, because I'm not above using the potions. We're just here to win with frogs, okay? That did zero damage. I'm going to need you to be a little bit better than that, Frogosaur. I'm going to be honest. You know what, Frogosaur? I believe in you. I believe in the power of frog. Nope, don't need to heal. I believe. I believe. Sometimes you just have to believe in frogs and they'll never let you down. They'll never let you down for a second. Living on one HP is definitely hurting my feelings, but as long 
as they don't crit, we're in the clear. And everyone is stoked on us. And there it is. Walrus may have taken down a few other frogs in its day, but not us, not today. Bye bye, Charmander. Bye bye, Starly. First real battle done. The frog took out two natural enemies birds and fire breathing dragons. Nothing can knock us down. Except for C. Dot. <laughs> Except for C. Dot. All right, cool. I'm not. I'm not dawdling. I'm. I'm adventuring. I'm. Ex I'm hanging out with my frog friends. Why would you, it's not dawdling. I'm just having a good time with the frogs. Sometimes you just have to hang out with the frogs, man. I don't know why you said dawdling. Acorns are scary. I. I'm not going to apologize for that. Also, chat. To, to, you know, to, to break out of the frog fun for just a second, I do want to say thank you guys so much. I I never really get a chance to truly thank you guys. Um, with YouTube, YouTube's such an interesting, you know, medium. I upload videos. I want the videos to do well. I want people to enjoy the videos. That's kind of where the conversation ends. You know, Twitter, Instagram, only so many people follow me there. But recently, Pokemon 7 Place has been incredible. But not just that, I mean, the VODs channel, people are so, like, we're enjoying the VODs so much, the chat streams. I have never had 400 people watching me for a Pokemon stream. And this is really special, and it's not lost on me, and I just, I want you guys to know I really appreciate it. I'm excited to make this run as fun as it can be. And, uh, you know, I'm hopeful I can keep streaming more and more and bring you guys some really, really fun series. So thank you guys, and let's let's see what we can do. Hey, right, I'm I'm really glad people have enjoyed the vods as much as they have. It's something I honestly I never expected a vod channel to be as popular as it is, and it it's really cool because when the new games come out, I can upload my entire playthrough every moment I play on the vod channel. And you know, rather than trying to edit you know a big series down to one video, hey, you want to see every second of me playing the new platinum game or the new fourth gen games? Boom, there it is. But for now, I am Frog Man. I I'm off to find frogs. Who are you? Sure. Oh wait, what? Dex Nav. Wait, what? Okay. Dex Nav. Dex Nav. Stealing clout from Mikey. By streaming with frogs? It's stealing clout. Do do you does does Mikey does Mikey have a frog that knows Supreme? I'm not stealing clout. I I got a Supreme frog shirt. What are you talking about? Clout. Hey, 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 come on. Come on. Hey, you know you know there's no other content creators with Supreme frog shirts. Come on. Come on, what are you talking about? Stealing clout from Mikey. What is that? That's chaos. Come on, boo, boo, boo. We can use this to get special ability or hidden ability frogs. This is amazing, chat. <gasps> what if we got a shiny frog? Oh my God. Wait, what are the shiny odds in this game? Chat, quick. Wait, quick. Chat, what are the shiny odds in this game? Can I get a shiny frog? That's pretty exciting. One in 512, that is that is possible. We could do that. Oh, that's big. That's big. That's very big. All right. Uh, do you battle or do you give me something cool? Pumpkaboo, that is such a cool encounter in here. You? Oh, that's really cool. Oh my God. This game is sick. Wow. I don't play competitive Pokemon anymore, but I played enough competitive Pokemon that a game like this, that's so competitively focused, it's really cool. I might have to try, I don't know, I might have to try some more games like this. It's interesting, in polls, a lot of people have been saying they don't want to watch Nuzlocke's for me. Even though I feel like my skill set's probably perfect for Nuzlocking, but the way I make content is probably, probably a little bit too goofy. 
Gen 3 man, are you Brendan? Why are you looking for a Joltik? You're the Gen 3 guy. Did you say Joltik? Why do you want a Joltik for Brock? Am I going insane? What's happening here? It is Brendan. Poor fish. I'm gonna eat that. I'm gonna eat this thing for breakfast. Are you foolish? What, what's going on here, Brendan? You think your measly little crawfish can stand up to the might of a frog? They might be swimming in the same stream, Brendan, but they are not on the same level. Trico, a friend of frogs everywhere, but even, even a frog as old and wise as Frogosaur knows when you have to put friendship aside and do what's best for the frog team. This is Team Frog. We're taking out the Trico and moving on. It's fine. Take out the Trico. We say goodbye and we keep moving. All right. So you know what, Trico? I'm going to cushion your fall with some magical leaves. Goodbye, little, little lizard man. Goodbye. All right. That was, that was great, Brendan. Ooh. This game is incredible. Oh, we, that does not matter because we're playing on the, the not having to train up as much mode. But that's sick. Man. This is awesome, guys. This is so cool. Okay. Uh, you, sure. We'll grab that. I don't know what I was saying before. I'm going to be honest, chat. In my mind, I got very confused. Oof. Poison powder, sleep powder, poison powder, sleep powder, poison powder, sleep powder, poison powder, sleep powder, poison powder, sleep powder. Do 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 do. I think we go sleep powder because we already can leech seed things. So I think putting something to sleep would be more helpful long term. I think that's going to be the most helpful. Stun spore also could be a little bit more helpful. We'll have to really pick our options. Okay. Get rid of Tackle. I don't think at this point we can get rid of Tackle. Because we only have one Pokemon until we get the Poliwag. And it's just still going to be helpful in a few situations. Like the situation we're currently in. Um, I don't know. I could regret that. But I assume there's going to be a move relearner at some point. I don't know. I've been wrong before. What qualifies as a frog Pokemon? Is there a list? Um... There's a list somewhere, but I've kind of just done like the eye check and then looked into them. Bulbasaur, it's a frog. You look into it, it says it's a frog. Poliwag, it's a tadpole and it turns into Poliwrath and Politoed, two more frogs. Toxicroak, we, I mean, th that Krogunk, we know those are frogs. Seismitoad has Toad in the name, easy. And then Froki evolves into Frogadier. Frog is literally in its name. So those are all frogs. Um, I don't think there are any more frogs. I think fellow frog enthusiast in vivid color a deemed Kiram a frog, but I think that was more like as a joke or a bit than it's actually a frog. And I don't think there's any, like I think calling another Pokemon a frog as a bit is like the only other loose connection to frogs of anything. So I've been rugged for, yeah, Greninja is one of the ones, but I'm pretty sure in this game, there are six total like fully evolved frogs we can get. Toxel may be based on different lizard and frog species. That's interesting. Low Tad is a Tad. I mean, we could we could go with Low Tad, but I mean, we wouldn't be able to evolve it. So I mean, Low Tad could just be like a Low Tad could be a mascot because the frogs are you know chilling on the Low Tad. We could get a Low Tad and throw it in the box. That's some moral support. Does this mean you can catch Temple? Yes, it does. It does indeed. Toxtricity is a big maybe. I'm not entirely sure. Oh, I did not talk to these people. This guy is... I've never seen him in a Pokemon game. Oh. Okay. Sure. Oh, I thought, I thought they were going to, like, give me things. Oh, that's fine. Swamper is a, um... What is it? Like more salamandery? Like isn't isn't Mudkip like an axolotl or like a mudfish or something? 
Um, are you adding Greninja to your team after all? So chat. I love you guys dearly, but chat, I have a question. What Pokemon do you see under the chat? Like if you're watching the screen, what, what Pokemon do you see for the frog themed layout under your comments? I'm not saying that Froakie being on the layout is like the one guaranteed frog you should expect. Because I feel like I shouldn't say that because you guys are all uh, very intelligent, wonderful people who I very much appreciate as viewers. And I know everyone could make the connection. I know everyone's on top of it. Also, I'm pretty sure Froakie's in my like VODs art. Also, Pokemon 7 Poggies chat. If you guys have Twitch Prime or Amazon Prime, hey, you got Amazon Prime, connect that bad boy to Twitch for free. You can subscribe to me or your favorite streamer once a month. No extra charge. Exclamation points. Prime? Twitch? I don't know. Pokemon 7 Poggies, try it out. Uh, some people on Twitch say Pog, some people say Pog Champ. I don't think I've heard anyone say Pog Champ in a long time. But this is a Poggies family. And Pokemon 7 Poggies is the only way to really go. Now, do we have room to add another emote? Is there a possibility we add the sad business frog emote of Politoed uh, walking away with a briefcase? Very sad. That's it's on the table. Uh, maybe I'll set a, a sub goal and if we hit it, I'll get that made. But right now, we got one frog emote. Hey, we might get more. This is a big decision, though. Sludge is a... It's another special move. We need to get the money to change this guy's ability. Or not ability, nature. But I think for now, we're just going to accept this. Okay, I appreciate that, Sam. That makes it sound like it's not worth shiny hunting, but I do appreciate the heck out of it. Hey, Marlu, thank you so much for the prime. I appreciate the heck out of it. And you know what? Hey, hey, future people watching on the VOD channel, if you have Amazon Prime, I'm just asking politely. I'm not even asking you to come out to the streams. You enjoy watching the VOD channel more? Hey, good on you. But if you got Amazon Prime, create a Twitch account for free, connect that with Twitch Prime, and you can support me monetarily, you don't have to donate. You don't have to take anything out of your wallet. It's a it's a free thing. It's already included if you have the Prime. Now, I'm not saying go get Amazon Prime if you don't have it. That would be ridiculous. And I'm not that selfish. I'm just saying, you already got it. Why not me? Level cap is 15, so can I not get above 15? Wait. Oh, this is going to be tough. Okay. Hard capped level caps. Frog only, one frog, but rock Pokemon. And we have sleep powder, which was very smart. We have the wise glasses. We have sleep powder. We have the worst possible nature for this moment. But we do have frogs on our side, and we do believe in the power of frogs. So that's fine. We keep on keeping on. Okay. How much money do I have? I have some. I don't have, like, a lot, but, you know. I have some. Oh, man. What if that's the frog one? That's fine. Pewter City. Let's talk to everyone here. What? Huh. Oh, that's cool. And tell me to play other games. All right. Maybe. Cool. What? The randomizer setting? The, the abilities are different day to day? That is absurd. That is kind of... Crazy? Wow. Okay, this game is nuts. Huh. Okay, what's going on, old man? 
Hmm. You? Hmm. You? Hmm. You? Okay. Yeah? I am a... <gasps> I'm a frog. Oh, it's the only Pokemon I've seen? Bulbasaur. I am a Bulbasaur. <gasps> no, 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 no. Okay, okay, okay. This one will be Bulbasaur. And this one is... Reading? No, no. Voices, speech, feelings. Okay. I am... Oh, it'd be an important Bulbasaur. Hmm. I am a rare Bulbasaur. A rare and special Bulbasaur. Yes. I am a rare Bulbasaur. It does say a lot about me. We are really good friends now. Thank you. Wow, that was great. We're not a romantic Bulbasaur. Bulbasaur has a mission that it's ready to complete. After Team Frog takes down Walrus and the other enemies in this game, Frogosaur will settle down, have a family, and just, you know, retire into the wind. But for now, Frogosaur is focused eyes on the prize. It's not going to end up alone. No, Katie. ABC is uh, out to get you. ABC has nothing against frogs. It's it's very much a you thing. I, I hate to say it. I hate to see it. It's, it's tough, though. We can't bring that bad energy over to the frogs. That's very cool. Galarian, Meowth, Snover. Snover would be really interesting against this gym. I, I don't want to waste my money here. Hmm. Doctor Strange, I appreciate the heck out of you. No. I'll go. I'll go at some point. Hey, thank you, the Pokemon Go guy. I really appreciate you. Thank you, thank you. Old man with wisdom. Well, I'm poor. What is the egg? Is the egg like random? I, I need I need questions. I have questions. Give me answers. Okay? <laughs> By men. Random baby? They're just gonna hand me a random baby? That's highly illegal. I would know my fiance <laughs> is a doctor. <laughs> uh, she was delivering babies recently. Uh, she's working with babies. You can't just give out random babies. That's very against the law. Who is this old man and why is he allowed to do this? Hey, that's chaos. All right, you. What's going on in here? I will enjoy myself. I have a prehistoric frog, and this is this is a this is a big trip for the frog. Our prehistoric frog just wants to to see where its frog ancestors came from, and you know, really take advantage of this knowledge and take down Brock. Oh, cool. Ah. That's okay. No, you don't. I mean, you don't need to. I mean, like. Ah, uh, 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 but you. Ah, uh, uh, but. Bye. Uh, I was very overwhelmed. We have a new enemy. Hear me and hear me clearly. We hate Falkner. First he tried to take down the family and now he's against Team Frog. Walrus is a pushover. We hate that man. Birds out of here. Enemies number one, two, three, four, five, and seventy-eight.
down with the Falkner man. But it's okay, because it gives us an opportunity to open a pack, get our secret rare frog, freak out, and it'll be great. I'm going to probably, like, really rush through these packs, because I'm very... I'm assuming I'm going to need to buy another booster box to get the secret rare frog, because it's a secret rare. I may need to go through, like, five or six of these booster boxes. A lesser person would say just buy the secret rare card, but that's... That's silly. I want I want to open it on stream and, you know, use up more of my money. I messed this up so horribly. How did I do this? This is the rare card right away with gold writing. That's actually really beautiful. We're going to pretend like that didn't happen. That's fine. There's a knight. There's the hydragon. There's this disease thing. A. It's the smiger. It's the Smeagol tiger. Okay. Cool. And then it's a... Uh, why are there so many evil plants? I don't understand. It's fine. We're opening up one more and we'll go. Is this close to spelling Yu-Gi-Oh right? This is a, a hunt for a special frog card. It's not necessarily Yu-Gi-Oh. It is an ends to a means. It is an ends to a means to get a special frog. And also to get the perform, perform apple flip hippo. I'm, I'm all in on flip hippo. If I'm going to be honest. Summon gate. Well, that is genuinely my bad. I did not know that. Uh, Sig. Sigmar Karn. I'm, I also don't know how to say your name. So, hey, hand up. Genuinely sorry. I did not mean to insult your spelling. I should be more careful about that. Genuinely. It's tough because sometimes, sometimes it's funny when someone young makes a spelling mistake trying to insult me. But I, uh, I'll read each situation better. This is a sick card. Okay. Oxyox, everyone's favorite. A clover boar. Red Eyes Insight. This looks sick. Wait a minute. Red Eyes Insight. I think this is actually kind of a rare card. $4 card. $4 card. We're rich. We're rich, chat rich. Ooh. Whoa. This is sick. Wait a second. Whoa. This is a very cool card. This is very shiny. It's very golden. Chat. I love gold. I love yellow. This is sick. Hey, it's a $5 card! $5 card! Wee woo, wee woo, wee woo, wee woo! $4 card! $5 card! We are rich! We are rich! We're the richest Pokemon frog streamers in the world! Do 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 so that I can slowly, you know, make up the cost of buying a Supreme Frog shirt. And then we can buy frog-themed Kobe shoes. Which are very expensive because, uh, rest in peace, Kobe. But the shoes are cool, I promise. Every <laughs> Everyone's stoked on it. But yeah, we're back. We're back to the fun. We like to spice up the streams with cards every once in a while. And you know what? Hey, sometimes you gotta pick, uh... You gotta get cards that are themed to the stream. Frogs are poggies. It's not that frogs are pog, it's frogs are poggies. But uh, I don't think we can use items in battle, which is hurting my feelings. I'm gonna be honest, I don't like that. But uh, that's fine, because we're gonna keep on keeping on. <laughs> what? No. No. I am trying to get totally awesome. You understand. Wait, do I have to beat Falconer? No, there's no way. I don't have to beat Falconer, right? Do I have to? You have to beat Falconer? You have to beat Falconer. You have to beat Falconer. You have to beat Falconer? Like, you have to. Like, you have to beat Falconer. Like, you have to beat... You have to... A lot of people talk to me about Radical Red. A lot of people talk to me about Radical Red. A lot of people knew my plans with Radical Red. 
zero people informed me, hey, how, like, how are you gonna beat Falconer with only a Bulbasaur? Feels really absurd that no, like, no one said that. Feels like anyone who's played Radical Red, the first thing they experience is having to beat Falconer. I'm not saying I could have gotten, like, a warning. Like, I'm not saying that. I'm just, you know, saying we're going to have to find a really loose thread to get another frog. You can get to level 16 and evolve. I cannot. Um, There is a level cap. And let, can you really, do you get one experience every time? 496. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Hmm. If they you over level, they won't listen to you in this game. Okay. Okay, it's our first speed bump. Uh, we need to find a Pokemon that has a loose connection to frogs. Loose connection here. We're looking for a loose connection. Pokemon Go guy, I appreciate the heck out of you. All right, Fampy is a friend of me. I don't know if it's a friend of frogs. Katie, I don't know if giant spiders would help in this. <laughs> okay. Try the egg guy. We don't have the money for the egg guy, though. Hmm. Ghosts are dead frogs! <gasps> oh my god, that's so genius! That's so genius, yes! Yes! Wait, we need the ghastly. We need the ghastly. We can't beat Falconer with just a frog. I'm not giving up, though. I'm not a coward. Ghastly is a ghost. It's a nondescript ghost. And this Ghastly, I have been told, is the ghost of a fearsome frog warrior. We won't use Ghastly past Falconer, but this Ghastly has been trying to get even with that crook, that criminal Falconer for years. This is our ticket to taking down the mean bird man. Yep, this is it, chat. This is it. I cannot wait for overly serious people to tell me I'm wrong in comments somewhere. If you're against using the ghost of a past frog, you're what's wrong with this frog filled world. So, you know what? What was what was this ancient frog warrior? Oh no, Redwall Frog. Redwall Frogs. Nope, Redwall was a wonderful series of books I used to read. Come on, I need I just need a frog king. Just need a frog in the Redwall series. Just need a frog from the Redwall series. Croikle. Okay. Hmm. All right, there's a few named toads. That's fine. King Glagweb. Does that even fit? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Damn. Okay. Damp Watch. What? What happened with Damp Watch? Damp Watch was a male toad who lived in the Toadlands and was under Marsh Green's command. He, along with Death Coil and Whip Scale, captured Martin the Warrior. Yeah, all in. Damp Watch is the name. I'm all in. I'm all in. <laughs> I could not be more in. I'll get over the I'll go over the notifications in a second. Damp Watch, easy. Okay. Amazing. Uh, and mushroom would count as a frog because uh, it's a toad. That's a good. We're gonna start with this, and then we'll we'll move forward. We'll move forward to other, you know, possible frogs. We will. We'll do that, and we'll move on. 
Um, hey, True Dark, thank you very much for the $1, King. I appreciate you. All right, thank you for the Prime Daytime. Thank you, Caraxus, and thank you, Kid Justice, for the 500. I appreciate all of you guys. And JD Morno. Turn Falconer's birds into ghosts with ghastly. That's the kind of... That's the kind of energy we need right now. I right, chat. We're just going to do one loosely linked frog at a time. One loosely linked frog at a time. This is going to be a rental or permanent. It's going to be rental. It's like, have you ever seen like Lord of the Rings, right? Where they, they get the ghost army. And then once the ghost army helps them win that one battle, they release them from their duty. That's the same thing with this ghastly. It has a bone to pick specifically with Falconer. And once... Uh, the ghastly is done with its duty. It will float away to the heavens and finally uh, find peace. So let's uh, let's just do the thing. I have to imagine. Well, actually, wait, wait. What nature is this thing? Why is it minus special? Att Whatever. It's not minus speed. That's all that really matters. God damn. Are you kidding me? fine that's fine that's minus special attack yeah that's what i just said did i not did i not say it correctly because i was aware of what it was maybe i my brain didn't work sometimes my brain doesn't work i mean it's embarrassing when my brain stops working but like you know hey we're all frog you know uh, lovers of frogs here right like, no need to be embarrassed we all make mistakes. That's what matters. Wait, there's an experience share. Oh, I could just train up the, the Bulbasaur. Oh, let's do that. You can catch a young goose because it's a mongoose and they eat frogs. Did you just suggest I could catch a Pokemon that is known to eat frogs and then put the Pokemon that eats frogs on the team with my frog Pokemon? I'm a little confused. Do we have a traitor in our midst? Do we have someone who's like actively against frogs? Watching the stream? I feel like we can we get a frog chant going? I'm a little Axu. That is absurd. Wait, is Axu? Can we somehow turn Axu into a frog? We do a little research. <laughs> this would be absurd. I. Right. Aksu may draw inspiration from, uh, what the hell is this? Dai, Dicey, no don't, what? Two dog tooth, huh. It's a lizard, it's definitely a lizard. I tried, it's just a lizard. If we if we need to really stretch things even even more, we'll get back to it. But for now, we're gonna use the ghost of a frog, and that will work. Hey, look, shiny Grimer. <laughs> Ominous wind could be big. Wait. Oh crap. No, we can't. Oh, we cannot hit the rufflet right now. That's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We just need to hit a hypnosis. We might have to do the battle a lot of times. It's fine. I'm not going to give up. I won't give up on Ghastly. Okay. <sighs> um, you can find... You can find Timpo in the Viridian Forest. I'm pretty sure you can't. But if anyone ever, like, finds out for sure that I'm, like, missing a frog somewhere, feel free to let me know and I'll go back and snag it. No, I can't make an apple into a frog. Grimer and Muck are squished frogs. Right now, I, I feel pretty confident with the stretch of the ghost frog. That, like, actually sounds pretty believable. Like, I feel, I feel like I've convinced myself that this is fair. If we need to come up with crazier stories, we will. But for now, I think this is what we stick with. Sinistee because you can make tea out of frogs. Oh my god. <laughs> you can catch a snover because frogs live near trees. Chad, I have to say, I love everything. I love all of the thoughts that are being thrown out right now. <laughs> it's really amazing. I 
Nosebleed with the Twitch Prime. I appreciate you guys so much. Thank you to everyone who uses the Twitch Primes. I, anyone that wants to support, you know, monetarily just out of their pocket, it means the world. Like, you know, obviously like YouTube content, Twitch content, it's free content to consume. I need to make a living somehow, but um, I've been, you know, like successful enough and I'm just so lucky that I'm able to support myself with YouTube stuff. So I never expect anyone to support me with their own money on Twitch. But that being said, hey, if you got that Amazon Prime, you can throw the Prime my way. I appreciate that the most because I know that it's still monetarily helping me, but it's not forcing people to pay out of their wallets or out of their pockets would make more sense. So that's always the ideal thing. Text immediately, direct connection. <laughs> that might be the next thing if this doesn't work. Um, we're absolutely putting a curse on one of these Pokemon. Uh, that that is just happening. Okay, I need the young goose not to show up. Should you train in Verdian Forest? Make sure you're not missing anything. I mean, I could. I did research before this on where you could find frogs. Clearly not if this was possible, but that's okay. We can go into Viridian Forest. If uh, people think there's a possibility of um, missing things, why not? Do you know elephants are frogs? I love elephants. So, I mean, I'll I'll lie and say they're frogs, but... <laughs> we'll have to see. Hey, thank you so much, Aruiz. I appreciate you so much. Thank you, thank you. All right, Burmy, you gotta get out of here, man. You gotta get out of here. No, it's not Nuzlocke. There are six total frogs we're going to be able to get, and then a few really loosely linked frogs. A, a frog Nuzlocke of this game would be literally impossible, as we've already found out. Like, literally impossible. There is no chance you could win. Like, 0% chance. And when I asked people what I should do next, most of the people that watched me said, hey, we don't want to see more Nuzlocke's, so... I don't know if that's just like a lot of overlap with Mikey where, you know, Mikey dislikes Nuzlocke's and, you know, a lot of people that watch him are not the biggest fan of Nuzlocke's or if like the general Pokemon audience, general Pokemon 7 audience is just not the biggest Nuzlocke fans. Like, I don't know what the case may be, but um, yeah, I'm fine to do some more like difficult runs that aren't Nuzlocke's like this. But also I'll still do Nuzlocke's when it makes sense. I don't know. Yeah, mixing in some different challenges is always fun. I mean, the goal of the content I make is to always have creative ideas and hopefully be giving you guys stuff you have not seen before. And, you know, maybe it won't be. Maybe I won't always hit the mark, but I'm always going to try at least. Do what you enjoy and we'll watch it. I love that sentiment. I appreciate you saying that because it's very sweet. And, you know, people that are willing to watch whatever I do, I appreciate so much. I won't do that, though because at the end of the day, this has become a job for me and I take it seriously, you know? Like if you're gonna do anything, you gotta do it right. And you know, the way I'm successful is, like I have more people watching me do this than I've had for like any Pokemon series. So clearly this is an idea that a lot of people can enjoy and get behind. Ooh, Nightshade is helpful. And the more people are here, it's not, oh, that's just better for me. It means I'm entertaining as many people as possible. And I think that's really important. Um, so I appreciate the sentiment of, ah, oh, do whatever you want and we'll watch. That's nice, but uh, I want to make sure that I'm entertaining as many people as possible. You should play non-Nuzlocke of Emerald Kaizo. Maybe. I've considered doing a Nuzlocke or a, a Emerald Kaizo Nuzlocke, but having checkpoints after each, like, gym or major battle. I think that could be fun, but I don't know if, like, the... The really hardcore, hardcore fans would be like, I don't know if they'd be angry about it. <laughs> Either way. Oh, is there a ghostly? Frogger 2 ghost. Do we have a ghost theme? Haunted house. Oh my God. There is a haunted house theme. Graveyard Garden. Aye, right, this is it.
chat. It's time. Here we go. I hope you're ready for this chat. Falconer wasn't playing fair, so we recruited the help of a ghost of a frog from the past. The damn watch a toad warrior slain in combat by an evil bird here to claim revenge against Falconer and the creatures flying high in the sky. Once we defeat Falconer, Damp Watch will finally be at rest and we will set it free. But for now, we've, we've gotten the help of the ghostly frog. And now we can take on this evil, evil man. So let's see what's going on here. Rufflet, I'm gonna need you to be a little slower than me, pal. I'm gonna need you to be a little slower. Boom, there it is. Oh, that's big. Okay, that's big. Okay. Okay, we have to now go into Bulbasaur. How much does this do? No, why, why? 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 But what I do know is we're not giving up this early. I've seen a lot of people say we need to find more froggy friends. No, the new plan worked and the ghost of Damp Watch the Toad is not done yet. We don't even know the second Pokemon. We're not quitters. We are people who love frogs, okay? If we go away from our frog-based principles this early in the playthrough, People won't respect frogs. It might take 50 battles. We have got this. We're not going with frog. Fr no friends of frogs. It's got to be a frog. Frog only. I can say this is the ghost of a frog and sleep well at night. I can't add a spider and say that's a frog. I can't do it. I can't do it. So you know what, Falconer? This is our moment. This is our moment. It's fine. Watch this. Hypnosis. Okay. It doesn't one shot us. That's really good to know. Watch this. Curse. We're putting a curse on the bird. This is it. This is our moment. Watch this chat. Watch this. Okay. That was bad. That was really bad. That was really bad luck. That was horrible luck. I don't understand why my luck is so bad. It's fine. Whoa! Okay. If you curse the rufflet, they will switch eventually. This we're we're learning more. We're learning more. We're learning more. Why do you have sleep talk? What the hell? Okay, that's that's frustrating, but it's fine. Withdrew? <gasps> okay, this could be big. Come on, come on, come on, crit, 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 crit. Damn. We made progress today, though. We made progress. We made progress. Okay. We made progress. It's fine. Hey, Rebecca. Thank you so much for the $30 dono. I appreciate it. Oh.
Did you donate when I was gone? Yeah. Well, I thank you so much for the 15 bucks. Thank you for the 30. I really appreciate it. Bring back this poem I wrote for your streams. Forget your problems. You are totally safe here. Just be like an amphibian. Let the troubled land disappear. Also, I'm glad you didn't notice what I did during your baby bladder break, Kaffa. I thank you very much for the the kind frog words we needed. Thank you very much for the support. I appreciate it very much so. But chats, we do need to figure out some things. Chat, I'm putting the foot down. No friends of frogs. Loosely, loosely connecting a Pokemon to being a frog, sure. Can't be a friend of frog, it has to be a frog. If that means we need to get four more frog spirits to be on our team to have an entire, you know what? No, that's what we will do. I've watched Lord of the Rings too many times. We are recruiting an army of frog souls for one battle. One more chance for redemption and glory. We're going full movie. No, we're getting a full team of Gastlys. I cannot play that moment. I will lose my Twitch channel permanently. But that's okay. We're getting a full ghost team. We will name them after famous frogs, each one. What about Shuppet? I haven't seen Shuppet. Shuppet's kind of bad. But Shuppet, Shuppet's a puppet. I think, I think Ghastly is the best way to go, honestly. I feel pretty good with Ghastly. There it is. Let's see. What's our next? Ghost frog name. There's a family of frogs known as ghost frogs? Helio? Kit? How do you... What? How do you... How do you spell that? But what are the, what are the, what, what is a ghost frog? What, Eastern ghost frog? I mean, there, there's a, there's an entire species of ghost frogs. We just name it ghost frog. Don't overthink it. Helio is a family of frogs commonly known as ghost frogs. Perfect. Easy. Ghost frog. I, wow, this is becoming, this is feeling more and more real. Okay, we got, okay, we got Ghost Frog on the team. Perfect, let's get, oh, we use the desk, desk, uh, Dex Nav, John. Dex Nav, okay. What? Oh, that's cool. Cool. All right, boom. Um, what else are we gonna name this? Oh, the Royal Ghost Frog. I'm naming this one Royal. It's a Royal Ghost Frog. That's another type of Ghost Frog. Wow. Royal Royal Ghost. Wow, this is great. Confused of what's happening? Uh, Falconer is cheating, so we are, we're recruiting an army of ghosts that were frogs when they were alive. They were frogs that were killed, they became ghost Pokemon, and we are recruiting the help of the army of ghosts to help us win this next battle. Why do I love frogs so much? I don't know. Why does anyone love a certain animal so much? I I just I've always liked frogs. <laughs> I don't have like any like deep meaning to it or anything like crazy. I've just just always like frogs. <laughs> Sometimes it's just that simple. Perfect. That's what I like to see. Ghost frog, get strong, get strong. Yes. Glass frog. I sure we could name this one glass frog. Cause it's see-through. I think that's that's fair. 
Could you eat frog legs? No, I'm not gonna eat frog legs. What? I live in a part of the country where nobody eats frogs. I don't even know where people eat frog legs. Uh, why would I want to eat frogs? They're one of my favorite animals. Why, why would I want to eat them? Do you guys eat some of your favorite animals? Like, are there people out here who love like chickens as pets and they're just like, wow, wow I have all these pet chickens. I can't wait to eat more of them. I guess that's probably true. I don't know. I don't, I don't know what people, I, I don't know what people do. I ate a pizza with frog legs. What do you weird people in the South do? Why are you eating frogs? Stop eating frogs. Don't eat frogs with pizza. You know what? If, I, if you want to eat frog legs, whatever. Don't eat frogs and pizza. That's, that, that is the weirdest combination. Forget pineapple on pizza. Frog legs and pizza is so weird. I, I need somebody to answer for that. That is chaos. What do you mean? What do you mean? Frog legs and pizza. I'm, I'm so upset. Oh, Rebecca, man. Thank you so much. That's so kind. Thank you so, so much. Hey. Thank you. Thank you so freaking much. Enjoy your froggy quest. I got to do other things, but I'm very much rooting for you and your frogtastic companions. Thank you so truly much. It means the world. Another five gift subs. I thank you guys. The support is very appreciated. Thank you. Thank you all. I really appreciate it, man. Oh, man. Uh, where am I? I want another red wall frog. Um, hmm. Where is it? Where's the red wall frog? Yeah, there we go. Uh, what is What the heck is this? A fat toad who ruled the, the toad lands. Okay, I will name it. Boy, come on. I... He was a frog king that ruled the lands. Or a frog queen. Hey. Fine with it. Perfect. Okay. That's an army of ghosts. Let's get our army ready and then we will finally destroy Falconer. I'm getting very worried that I'm not going to be able to beat Brock with just a single Bulbasaur. But you know what? I'm not a quitter. We'll figure it out. We will figure it out. I love the stream idea. Keep doing what makes you happy, King. Thank you so much, Very Sherry. I appreciate the heck out of it, truly. Thank you, thank you. Wait, is everyone still talking? Hey, chat. We had a fun little, like, time and bit talking about eating frogs. There, we can only, like, there's only so much talking we can do about it. It's, like, a very simple thing. If chat's still talking about it, just throw on, ask anything, man. Any other question. I don't know what's going on here. <laughs> oh, man. I used to think you were just overly positively in a fake way, but after watching you for a while, I've realized you're genuinely just a nice, positive, great guy who likes entertaining. Well, thank you so much. I really, I really do appreciate that. It is something I have kind of thought about and worried a bit about of people. Um, Because there, there are some people who mistake my positive attitude as I am a person devoid of negative emotions and obviously like everyone in the world i you know i have good moments i have bad moments but i really am blessed and happy to do with what i do like to do what i do and you know i every time i sit down to, to especially stream it it puts me in a good mood and there's been times where i've you know i had to end streams early because i haven't you know maybe i got like a little anxious or there was you know something messing with my mental health uh, but usually just sitting down, it's, it, I'm really excited to hang out and, you know, I, I, there's so much negative going on in the world. If, if I can sit here and throw a little positivity at people, my, I feel like I've had a productive day. I mean, the way I look at it, right, there's a lot of ways, like everyone has a different measure of success and, you know, what's meaningful. But for, for me, I feel like I've had a, you know, successful, meaningful day if I have made someone's day a little bit better. And maybe that maybe that's just me. Maybe that's a day where I just made myself happy. Eh, you know, sometimes it can be tough, and, you know, to do something for yourself. But if I can every day make someone 
happy. I feel like I had a good day. So, I don't know. That's how I look at things. I like to have a positive spin on things. One thing I've tried to do more and more, and this is something I feel like anyone can do, in a negative situation, try to find a positive spin zone. Like something negative happens, big or small, just trying to trying to find a little grain of positivity, you know? Like, I was talking to my dad on the phone earlier, and he was like, man, you know, he had, he'd gotten me and Nikki a special trip, celebrating, you know, like, birthday, Christmas, her becoming a doctor, and, you know, we were going to go to uh, England, and, uh, you know, just, like, sightsee and see some special things, and he was really, he's been really, really bummed out we haven't been able to go, and I said, well, you know, hey, a nice spin zone on that is, you know, we weren't able to go, but we're getting older, and as time goes on, we're able to save more and more money, and when we're able to go this time, we'll be able to enjoy it more and maybe do a little bit more and, you know, not be as worried about finances. So the trip will hopefully be better overall. I mean, we haven't been able to go, but, you know, the time waiting doesn't have to be a full negative. You know, maybe it'll just, it'll be a better trip now. So, I don't know. I, I feel like there's... Sometimes it's more difficult, but if you can find even just the smallest little spin on something, it's nice. I kind of want to be timed out of chat because it's never happened to me before. Is that weird? That is incredibly weird. Hopefully me acknowledging your message is... better than getting timed out. It is very weird to go to a chat and want to get banned or timed out. Like, just very weird. But we're all different, I guess. I don't know. I assume anyone who says that just kind of wants to be noticed. So hopefully if I acknowledge you, then, you know, your bizarre desire to get timed out will go away. You know, frogs and salamanders have a common ancestor, Dutch. Thank you. I may need to use that soon. You just pope to follow? A pope follow me? Is that what's trying to, are you trying to say that? Seems highly unlikely, but if it's true, that'd be crazy. Uh, th that'd be probably the craziest thing that's ever happened to me. That's interesting. <laughs> There's a gopher frog. Have you seen a fat rat? Oh, man. Oh, man. Man, oh, man. <sighs> we're almost, we're almost where we want to be. So, chat, I think the question is... The army of ghosts... Are the ghosts here to help us get through the Falconer battle and the first gym, or are they just there for the Falconer battle? That's a big question. That's a big question. Salamanders and frogs are their own subgroup of amphibians, separate from whatever else is amphibian. Okay. Depends on the gym. I think, well, yeah, we'll keep them on standby and we'll see. Yeah, we'll definitely try to beat them without them. Okay, we'll see. We'll, we'll, we'll see what's going on. I should have a little bit of water. It's easy to forget to hydrate. Especially with your when your entire chat makes fun of you and your baby bladder. But I still gotta hydrate. Even, even if I'm gonna get bullied. The game's the game. Also, I should probably just train these guys up better. Yeah, let's just do this. Perfect. Absolutely not a Nuzlocke. A frog-only Nuzlocke of Radical Red we found out is quite literally impossible. Like, there is a, no way you could win. Okay. What moves does your Bulbasaur have? It has a grass move and it has a poison move. Proud of you, baby bladder? I don't know if you have to be proud of me for having a small bladder, but you know what? It's not a negative. You're not throwing out a negative. It's an interesting compliment, an interesting thing to be proud of me for, but you know, we'll figure it out. I don't know about you, Grime, or I don't know about you, Grimey Grime. Just get Poipal out of the egg, but for 5k, uh, I am losing money at a, a rapid pace, a breakneck pace. Chad, I really appreciate all the suggestions. 
But I didn't say I was going to do a frog only run just to like truly, truly bend the rules. We're going to bend the rules as much as we deem necessary. But uh, here's also a not fun look into YouTube, right? So we live in an age where people have the attention spans of flies. They, they are very, like very, very small attention spans. And I have found, right, you do a, a, a playthrough, and even if it's like a fun little, oh, we're cheating, oh, we're doing a, a little bit of a goof, we're all in on it. It could cause the video that would eventually be made from this to go from a video that like a lot of people enjoy to, oh, he used non-frogs, click off immediately, not give the rest of the, the video a chance. So for my sanity and happiness, because I love this idea, I'm going to break the rules or stretch the rules as little as humanly possible. I love the idea of the ghostly frogs helping out. But once you move into, well, it's definitely not a frog, but like it could be like kind of related to them. That's when you're in an interesting spot and it's, you know, we got to figure things. We got to figure things out little by little. Now the game making it truly impossible to continue without stretching the rules, we'll do that. But past that, I want to see if this is possible. Hey, we'll fi we'll figure that out. We'll figure that out, Mr. Sam. We'll figure it out. Yeah. We're in the middle of the run. Now, if you had told me this, like when we talked about the, the radical red playthrough, like, ooh, you got to do something. Maybe I would have found a different different thing but we're uh we're two hours in so we're just gonna do what we're gonna do yeah the chat decides rule video bomb because everyone got mad at john for hacking and shinies this is actually very true that video has done well over time thankfully that video truly bombed because the youtube audience got really upset over the fun little thing i did there and I, honestly that really hurt that one really kind of scarred me a bit it's like, man, I thought this was a fun bit. Well, I've been wrong. Hmm. We're almost there, chat. I know we can beat Falconer this way. And we might, we may have to get, we may have to bring the ghosts along to our next journey. I mean, it's, I think the craziest thing I ever learned as a YouTuber is, the amount of people that click off on a video right away is crazy. Like, if I have a one minute intro for a YouTube video, 50% or more of every person that has clicked on the video has clicked off the video before my intro ends. So if you wonder why a lot of my intros are shorter, it's because by the data, like, even on like a 10 second, like intro, 20% of the people that clicked on the video have already clicked off. It's crazy. Like, I don't know what people's perception of YouTube or YouTubers are, but the amount of like research and deep thinking I do into even little things like an intro for a video, it's it's a lot. It is. It's one of those things like, I don't know, like every little decision gets a lot more scrutiny than I'd imagine. Or maybe half of them just clicked on the wrong video. There's, I mean, hey, there's a very real chance of that. That kind of data, I don't know if I, I don't know how I can find that data. Yeah, it's, it's a really crazy thing. Um, lick. Hmm. Okay. Is Arceus a frog? I wish, man. I wish. That, they are also, they could be ghosts from all the time. Bulbasaur fainted. That is another way to spin this. You are not completely wrong there. Okay, let's see. People forget to turn off autoplay. I mean, possibly. Well, you know what? The frog team is gonna capture the hearts of thousands. Chat, this, this is a team that everyone can get behind. You know, this, this is gonna unite Pokemon fans of all ages together to root for the team of destiny, frog. 
There's a channel called Pokemon Summon Plays? That's the second channel I've heard about impersonating me. First, Pokemon 7 VODs is uploading my streams. And now this? Chaos. My royal ghost. That's crazy. It's probably Mikey. He's so jealous of my full head of hair that he's... he's Stoop to uh, becoming a Pokemon 7 imposter. It's... It's not becoming, if we're gonna be honest. And my height, that is true. That's a good point. Very good point. I, yeah, I can't forget that. But what I cannot and will never forget is what's about to happen. Chat, the ghostly frog music. Let me loop it, this is important. Chat, it's time. It's time, chat. That's fine. I forgot where I was going. I got I got too excited, too ahead of myself. Here we are. We have finally rounded up an army of ghostly frogs. A royal ghost frog. Damp watch, a toad in the past, a ghost frog, a type of frog. Oi, come on, uh, a royal, royal frog, a queen of many. Glass frog, and of course, frogosaur. Our ghostly frog army is gonna help us finally fell this cruel beast. Caddyshack with a 25, thank you, we needed that to get rid of the evil birds loving the streams and love the merch keep killing it king thank you so much it's what we needed falconer i have rounded up every ghostly frog you have slayed they're back for vengeance i don't care why you're here or what you're doing it's time to bring you down once and for all This rufflet has killed scores of frog warriors before, Royal Ghost. Put it to sleep. That's fine. Go for the curse. It's fine. Go for the curse. You're not getting away that easily, rufflet. Not getting away that easily. On to the next. Damp watch. You've been here before, you know what to do. May your hypnosis never fall on deaf ears. The rufflet is gone. Boom, into a mulga, perfect. Now this is a sleep talking amulga, which is not our favorite thing. We're gonna go immediately into Frogosaur. We're gonna leech seed this thing and then go back into a ghastly. We can do this. It, it's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. That wasn't fine. I still believe, though. I believe. It's fine. I believe. I believe. We got this. We're living. Easy. Leech seed. Get some health back. Get some health back. All right. Not perfect, but it's fine. We go back into ghost. Yep. Predicted. I'm always ahead of ya. You can critical hit all you want, Amulga. I'm fine with it. I'm gonna put you to sleep. Alright, Amulga outspeeds. The leech seed was very important. The leech seed was very important. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Let's bring back in Damp Watch. Let's do it. It's fine. That's fine. Hypnosis. Roost! Ooh. That's fine. That's fine. We put it to sleep. And now we're just gonna Ominous Wind. Heal just in case. I don't think I can heal. Can't heal, chat. Ominous Wind. Let's get the boost. Let's get the boost. Come on. 
Stop it. Stop sleep talking. It's so rude. You are a rude little squirrel. Oh, you're soaring through the, the, the sky. Ooh, look at you, little squirrel. I hate you. I hate you so much. Why do you have a berry? Okay, it's fine. Okay, it's it's fine. Oh my god. Whatever, whatever. We're gonna get we're gonna get some more health and we're gonna get the boost. We're gonna get the ominous wind boost. Okay, I don't know if they can kill, but if they don't kill, we kill it. Yes! Boom! One of the flying evil beasts down. Okay. Okay, what's next? Yes! They bring back in Rufflet the perfect time to go for curse. Okay. Okay. It's gonna lose some health. Aerial Ace. I think Rufflet is always going to switch. So if Rufflet is always going to switch, we bring in Frogosaur, we leech seed the next Pokemon. No, it didn't switch this time! But it's gonna get a fix. Okay, it's gonna get hit by the, the curse though. It's gonna get hit by the curse. Okay. I don't like that. That's it's gonna Oh god. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. It's not we're not it's we're not done yet. We're not done yet. We caught this guy at level 15. Mean look? Damn it, no! Okay. Corvus score. Okay. Boost. That did so much damage! We outspeed and it did so much damage. You dumb, stupid bird. You dumb, stupid bird. We got this. We got this. We got this! No! 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 Yeah, maybe. It's fine. Come on. We need... Min max, 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 min max. The queen of toads. Here you are. Boost. Boost. All right, whatever. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. One, one left. One left. One stupid bird. One. Come on. This can't do anything, can it? No. This is a big moment. It's not over yet. It's not over yet. 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 I believe chat. Who was here? Who was here? Chat. The ghosts of many fallen frogs before. Teaming up with Frogosaur, the wisest frog of them all. To create something 
special. Something magical. No one can beat the combined might of Team Frog. Nobody can defeat frogs at their mightiest. Falconer, you tried your best, but you didn't succeed. Leave this land and never come back. I'll take it. We did it. Wow. That was big. That was big. All right, chat. Let's go heal and make some big decisions. Let me confer with the queen of this ghostly frog army. Boy, come on. I will release you of your frogly warrior duties if you can help me win one more battle. The frog army can rest. We just need to take down Brock. I just need you. Damp Watch, Ghost Frog, Royal Ghost, and Glass Frog. The souls of five restless warrior frogs one last time. What say you? One more. One more battle chat. One more! We got this. That's fine. Accuracy reducing moves and evasion raising effects have been removed. Sleep clause is in effect, meaning only one Pokemon per team can be put asleep. Okay. Sure, I get it. This is a competitive Pokemon battle. That's sick. Awesome. Okay, cool. It's a very difficult gym battle. I understand you, nerd. Let me battle this man. It's, we're, it's not that time yet. Okay. Roly-coly, that's fine. Frogosaur, it's been some time since you were able to defeat measly Pokemon Roly-coly. Okay. We got this. What is the perfect song for this? What is the perfect song? Hmm. Hmm. No, we already listened to that. Hmm. Okay. I need to think. Pop smoke. <laughs> that was good. Hmm. You know what? Keep it simple, stupid. Keep it simple, stupid. Frogosaur, ghostly frog army, it's our time. It's our moment. Rock, Brock, if you tell me about your rock hard Pokemon one more time, I am going to call many different authorities. I'm here for a battle and nothing else. Let's just get this over with, man. Geodude, easy. You fool. Does a lowland Geodude have sturdy? We'll find out. We'll find out together as Team Frog. 
It has 30. It's going to go boom. I could have switched into a ghost and prevented all of this. It would have been the easiest switch of my life. Doesn't matter. I lived. Frogosaur is stronger than your stupid little rock, Brock. And this was a learning moment for you. Vulpix. Oh, oh, my name's Brock and I cheat. I have a fire Pokemon in the, the rock gym. Sick, dude. Awesome. That's fine. Damp watch. I'm raining on your parade today. <laughs> Incinerate. Nope. Not going to do what you think it's going to do. Not even a two shot. Not even a two shot. Hypnosis. Right to sleep. Bye bye. Good night. Goodbye, Vulpix. Goodbye. Ominous Winds, this is where we get the boost. Damp Watch. Damp Watch. Damp Watch! What? It doesn't matter. You can cheat all you want, Brock. You can cheat all you want. It doesn't matter. You won't beat me. You can't beat me. You cannot beat Team Frog. <sighs> That's fine. We need the berry gone, if nothing else. Rock Tomb. It is what it is. Glass Frog. Be true to your name. You're a glass can and you put a curse on that onyx and we're gonna keep on moving. Rock tomb, fine, here for it. I understand how that goes. You're gone. Onyx, the berry juice is gone. It's afflicted by curse. We bring in ghost frog now. We go for hypnosis. We'll hit this or we'll hit whatever hit comes in on the switch. He did switch. Perfect. Archen will be asleep now. Why do bad things happen to good people? It doesn't matter. We outspeed this fraudulent bird. Go back. I don't know, like the... Jurassic Park. I don't I don't know where you're from. Just die. I want you dead. I want you dead and gone. Become a fossil again. No one should have reanimated you. You are a disappointment to your entire family, your entire lineage. Archen, go away. Okay? You're in defeatist. You are defeated. You are a dumb little bird. There is nothing you can do to win this. If we can hypnosis though, if we can hypnosis. Damn, that would have been big. <sighs> Damn. Okay. <sighs> that would have been a really, really big play. It's fine. We're still fine. We outspeed, we can kill with ominous winds and we just keep going. Okay. They can't switch. We put a curse on this onyx. Hmm. No, we hypnosis. All right, or we just keep missing hypnosis over and over again. We just keep missing hypnosis over and over again. Now we have to hit hypnosis. It's the only chance we have of winning. Okay. There's a few plays we could make here. We could stay in Curse and then Ominous Wind, or we could immediately switch into Bulbasaur, and if it stays asleep two turns, we kill it. I think Ominous Wind wins no matter what two of them. But if we Ominous Wind and then it Rock Tombs and then we are slower. Hmm. 
We have one frog still standing, still alive. If we're going to beat this gym, we're going to do it the right way, the frog way. Oh my God. Why? Why? I just, I just wanted a moment with my frog. I don't ask for much. I ask for so little. We were going, if we, okay. Spin zone, spin zone, spin zone. If we had stayed in, we would have lost actually. Oh, we missed anyways. All right, doesn't matter. We had no chance. We were not lucky. We were going to lose that battle no matter what. Nope. Because they hit Rock Tomb, we lose the speed. So even if we had Ominous Wind, they kill us in two. That was it. Nope, didn't matter. We lost no matter what. <sighs> that is annoying. I miss competitive Pokemon. Competitive Pokemon is so cool. Like, trying to take Pokemon seriously is sick. Because you come up with a plan, and then... Yeah, let's just open packs. You out, I outsped Onyx with Ghastly. Ghastly doesn't one shot the Onyx. The Onyx woke up first turn, goes for Rock Tomb, gets the speed drop on the Ghastly, meaning it outspeeds the next turn, two shots the Ghastly, I still lose. The only way I possibly win by going for an attack is going for Ominous Wind and getting a crit. That was my only chance of winning with the unfortunate hacks that went down. Um, So I made the correct plays, just got unlucky. Rock Tomb and the Speed Drop prevents me from just attacking first turn and working. But that's okay, because we have a secret rare frog that we're about to pull, and everyone is going to be excited, okay? There are butterflies, there are evil plants, there is a space dragster, and then... Oh my god, I thought it could have been the... I thought it could have been the card. It's a pretty cool looking card, but it's fine. Are Ga Gastly's frog Pokemon? Well, they're ghosts. They are ghosts of frog warriors in the past. I mean, what, 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 what did you think Ghastly was? I mean, it had to be a ghost of something, right? It had to be a ghost of something. What card are you looking for? A secret rare frog. Totally awesome. All right. Oxy Ox, you guys, none of you are frogs. We need the secret rare frog. We need the frog energy here. No, uh, it's fine, chat. It's fine. We did not get the frog energy we so desired. But that will not stop us. And maybe we need something more inspiring. Maybe we need some more inspiring music. Nope. Death Mountain. We are using a ghostly army. I like the idea of Death Mountain being our song. I'm not going to put berries on the ghosts because I want to save the berries for later battles because I know I can win without berries. Chat, I think this might be our final battle with the ghostly frogs. Haunter wouldn't be licking everything if it wasn't a frog in its past life. That is exactly, you understand. You know what, Brock? If you tell me one more time about the rock hard Pokemon, I'll fight you myself, okay? I, I'm, I'm taking matters in my own hands. You started the first battle with a, an exploding Geodude, huh? You thought going for self-destruct turn one against a team full of ghostly frogs was smart. No, these frogs have been in many wars. They've seen just about anything. You can go boom with your foolish rock all you want. It's gonna bring you nowhere. You sad little man. What's next? Vulpix? That's funny. That's real funny. Go to bed. 
Ominous Wind, Boost, Royal Ghost, taking your entire team down by itself. Easy. Oh, oh, your Vulpix has Ominous Wind too? Yeah, that's cool. Uh, let's two shot it. You could eat a berry, I guess. You really want to be gluttonous. I guess you can. God, why? How? What the hell? Berries are reusable in trainer battles? What do you, wait, we might have to look into that after this. I don't even understand what that means. There it is. Come on, damp watch. No, what? I call malarkey shenanigans. Uh, -a 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 uh, what is this? I. Queen of the toads come out. Get the boost. Get the boost you were always meant to get. That's fine. That's fine. We're not lucky. We don't need to be lucky. We don't need luck. We make our own luck. Easy. 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 We need a free switch. We need a free switch into the frog. Hmm. That's not what I meant to do. The smart play would not be to switch, but I can't let the queen go down that way. Glass frog is here for a reason. You did your job and you did it admirably. That's fine. That's fine. You didn't know the ghost of frogs before? Count it as frogs while you're learning today. You can bulldoze all you want, Onyx. You're a weak, weak little rock. And I'm taking you down today. Huh? Fine. Doesn't matter to me. Doesn't matter to me. Frogosaur, this is the moment you've been working towards. There's nothing the Onyx can do now. And there it is. The Onyx goes down. One more Pokemon to defeat. Just in case we somehow live. I knew there was no chance, but hey, you never know. Come on, ghost. Just get damage on this thing. Get this into defeatist. Don't mess around. We don't mess around with threats around here. We don't mess around with threats. Oh! And you finally miss and in perfect time come on into defeatist rock tomb all you want Ugh. barely a scratch that's fine it doesn't matter it doesn't matter I have no berry for you to consume archin goes down Brock defeated. And Team Frog finally gets 
the first badge of the playthrough. I'll take rock, Tim. I appreciate it. Now it is time to say goodbye. We need proper music. We need a nice song to send them off. Not that. Hmm. We need a nice relaxing song. Hmm. Fair. Bad idea. Very handy in a tight spot, these lads. Despite the fact they're dead. And while that may be true, it's finally time for the ghost souls of fallen frog warriors to rest. This isn't as much goodbye as good job on a fantastic battle. And an incredible life. We will remember all you've done. Have your eternal slumber now. One by one. The frog ghosts may finally rest. And we move forward to a new frog actually on the team. What do you mean this is my last Pokemon? That is not my last Pokemon. Queen Frog. What a sweet moment. After all she's done in her incredible life and for Team Frog, the Queen of the Frogs. Doesn't want to leave. That's fine, though. That's fine. I know the issue, Queen. It can be tough. It can be tough to say goodbye. But you've done more than enough. Finally, rest. We won't forget you. But chat, badge number one acquired. The ghost frogs are gone and now it's time to make our way to catch a brand new frog. I've been told by little birdie that if we go to Mount Moon at night, we may find Tim Pole. Will we catch five Tim Poles so we can have a full roster of frogs because things are going horribly? Yes, yes, we absolutely will. I appreciate that, Sam. I appreciate the heck out of that knowledge. I don't have enough money because I am poor. So let's see. Level cap is 27 for Misty. Oh, that is music to my ears. You, I need you to leave me be. I have a frog to go catch. Oh, well, now my feelings are just hurt. I don't like that one bit. Let's open up a pack. 
Let's open up a pack and find our secret rare frog. That's what we'll do. That's what we'll do. One, two, three. Boom. Easy. All right. Flower stacking. Sure. Cool card. Sure. Sprite's blessing. Bless me with a frog. Cypher twin raptor. Amazing pendulum. Flower guardian. Beony with butterfly. Oh, I thought it was the card. I thought it was the card. Oh, I really did. I really did, chat. Chat, we are ripping through this booster box so unbelievably quickly. But chat, I need to know if I need another booster box to get this Toad card. One, two, three. It's so important. Chat, would it be foolish to buy one expensive pack of like a gen, like gen two cards to try to get a hollow poly toad? Or stupidly more to just buy like a PSA 10 holographic polytoad from the Gen 2 side. What do we... How how far do the frog, the love of frogs go? That's, that's a big question. Reform... Okay, seal eel. I'm here for that. Mare Mare. Super heavy samurai soul peacemaker. And... Oh, I used... Whatever. It's fine. It's fine. Why not buy it? I, it's probably super expensive, I'm gonna be honest. It's probably like... It's probably absurdly expensive. But it's fine because we are moving forward towards a brand new frog on the team. I did look at you. This is true. Please. I need... I need to change the nature of my frog. Please just go down easily. Thank you. I'm a little bit more worried about you, but we do that. We do this. Don't wake up that quickly. There we go. Thank you. I didn't have to overthink that. That was easy. All right, 264. We just need one more battle. One more to win. Okay? That's fine. We do not have any physical moves. We're going to get Ivysaur too. Oh, there we go. Yes! Okay, chat. This... This is big. We're Team Frog over here. Come on. Here it is. The first frog evolution of the playthrough. Would have been nice to have an Ivysaur in the last gym, but you know what? We found our way around Brock, and you know what? Ivysaur is going to lead us to great heights. I couldn't be more excited or more proud of Frogosaur. Yes, there it is. We have enough money, chat. This is big. This is big. Chat, this is everything we have worked towards. You, wonderful lady. Yes, I am so interested. Frogosaur. <sighs> I'm thinking modest. We could do modest or we could do timid. The extra speed could be nice, but I'm thinking of trying to get Drizzle Politoed so that we can get Swift Swim Pokemon. So I think Modest makes the most sense. We want this thing to just do a bunch of damage. And I don't think we're going to have any physical moves to worry about. Unless Earthquake. We might want to put Earthquake on this thing. I don't care about Double Edge on Venusaur. But Earthquake could be nice. But what would we want to have minus? Ugh. Earth Power. That's a good call, Dutch. That's a very good call. I think we go Modest. All right, we drop a bag, get modest, and you know what? We keep on keeping on. It's very true. We do have ground moves on Seismitoad, and we're on our way to get some Seismitoads. That's what I like to see. Good call, chat. Good call. Chat, I'm going to be honest. You guys have really been rock stars today. Ever since the chat run, my chat has gone from a chat that I'm going to be honest was kind of, kind of upsetting me like every other stream with just with chaos and a lot of talk of just not me or what was going on in the stream. Ever since the chat run, everything has changed and I really appreciate it. Every like day I'm not able to stream, it, like I'm really sad. I've really, really been loving these streams, loving these series and trust me, any day I'm not streaming, 
I am almost every single time recording stuff for YouTube. It just, unfortunately, you know, uh, for better or for worse, YouTube has to be my priority as that's just how this is my job. But uh, I do want to be able to do more and more Twitch because I really do love it. Hi, Dust Talks. You are very, very weak. But you know what? It is what it is. Sizzlipede, goodbye. Joltik, goodbye. Ooh. I'll take an Ornberry every day. When is the, the Canto Chat segment? I, actually, we can talk about that. I mean, I guess this will be on the VOD channel, so anyone who's been questioning what's going on there, we can we can go over it. I'm not going to be a, doing a Canto section for the chat series. I had originally planned to, but a few things happened. First, when I did research into doing Canto in a Hardcore Nuzlocke, almost no one continues Hardcore Nuzlocke into Canto. Second, every single wild Pokemon I would catch would be under-leveled, and then I'd have to naturally grind the Pokemon up to like level 50, or I would have to rare candy them up, which would most likely draw the ire of people watching on Twitch and on YouTube alike, saying that I was then cheating. So I just decided that the Elite Four was such a beautiful conclusion to the series that rather than continuing with a game where no one even cares about the Kanto gyms and just wants to see the team go against red, rather than wasting people's time with hours and hours and hours of content on that, I thought it would make a lot more sense to eventually get that video up and at some point do a platinum uh, run. Same thing um, using the, the cute charm glitch. Everything's named Chet and that can be the replacement for the Kanto um you know post game i think it would make a lot more sense just to just you do the fourth gen region rather than doing because kanto wouldn't really be that fun right i feel like it would just be better for you guys better for my time if we just eventually do a platinum series this has to be a, a tm right eh. <laughs> all right teleport i guess cool Okay. You? What the heck is that? No, it's Shroomish. That, you're, no. What's this? Huh. They actually have raid dens. This is kind of insane. Huh. Do it? Should I should I try it? I mean I guess I could. Uh I don't know. Okay. I'm so interested. This is crazy. It just went for Encore? Hey, we did get a poison on it. Nice, there we go, Fungus. Cool. Okay. Maybe Magical Leaf then? Ooh, I don't like that. Ooh, didn't kill the Fungus though. Speed fell, I'm fine with that. And it's only going for one attack a turn. Why am I not going large? I guess I could go large. Yo, Toxic Venishock? Whoa, that is sick. Oh my, this is crazy. How do I go large? What button, how do I, how do I do it? What do I do? Is it not like lit up? It's not my turn. How do I do it? Press enter. Whoa. Sure. The largest frog in all of the land. Yes. Wow. What a clutch turn. 
Wow, I Dynamax at the perfect time. Max Ooze, this is insane. Oh my God. Wow, this game is truly special. Wow. Wow, that was crazy. Yes! Wow, and Mega Drain now? Oh my god, let's go. Amazing. Jeez. Oh, I don't want to catch it. No, I want to end. Do I get something now? Okay. Sure. Wow. I guess that's not worth it. Ooh, four citrus berries for gym battles. Wow. Whoa. We're doing every raid den we see. That was so much. That was crazy. I did. He's not cool. He's like a very creepy man. He was saying some wild things to me. I didn't like any of it. Okay. Waterstone, cool. Hidden item. Oh, cool. Persian berry. I guess I understand why everyone wanted me to play this game. This game is sick. Okay. No. <laughs> All right. Um, time to catch Timple. So, one thing. Let me check Timple. I don't... What What did I just enable? Oh, crap. I clicked buttons. I did not mean to. What the heck did it just say I enabled? I'm so worried. Please let me know what it said. I'm so worried. Oh, Swift Swim isn't even a hidden ability. Oh, Auto Run? Oh. Cool. That feels helpful. Um... Do I want Water Absorb on any of these? Should we randomize frog run? Let's see if any, like, let's see how the audience reacts to beating this game with only frogs first. Let's go catch some frogs. Let's go catch some frogs. Let's go catch some frogs. Yeah! First Pokemon! First frog! Yeah! Team Frog becomes even stronger! Yeah! Oh, I'm so hyped. No one saw that! Nobody! Not a soul! Nope! Didn't see it! Did not see it! No! Nope! I... Whoa! Timpole? What? No way! That's crazy! What? No. Can you believe that? That's so insane. What? Ah. He did it. Ah. Timbal, yeah! There we go. Ooh, okay. So we're going to catch a full team of Timples because at this point we can get a full team of frogs legally. Now, we're only going to need one of these to continue when it becomes a Seismitoad, but we need to name all five of these good names. Oh, Frank. Oh, that's, we really do need to pay tribute to Frank. That's such a good call. Band nerd, I appreciate it. We like, we like callbacks to past series. We really like that. We really do. Frank. Oh, what item do you have, Frank? Petra Berry, fine with that. Hardy, sure. Hydration. Okay, it is the worst ability we could find, but that's fine. We just need to get one Swift Swim one. Just one. Okay, just one. There we go, that's another temple. It's fine. Okay, I like that already has Bubble Beam. 
That's fine. Not too worried about it. But it's asleep. Perfect. There we go. Another temple on the team. What are we naming it now? Jet's got to be reserved for shinies. We we gotta we gotta be consistent. A lot of people saying Kermit. This is a not green frog. Is this hardcore? No. Possible song. <laughs> I love it, Katie. I love it. Trevor the frog from Harry Potter. You know what? I'm fine with it. I'm fine with it. Hey. Good enough name for me. Okay, let's see. What's going on with Trevor? Swift swim. That's what we like to see. We needed at least one swift swim temple. Okay, perfect. You spelled it wrong. Well, this one is Trevor with an ER. This Trevor is special and unique. This Trevor doesn't conform to the Harry Potter frog norms, okay? It, it's its own frog. Oh, boy. I won't look anywhere else. There we go. I knew it was there. All right, Temple, we're gonna leech seed you immediately. No, leech seed, leech seed, there we go, perfect. Okay. We do stand Trevor with an E, thank you. Boom, there it is. Hey, that's very fair, yeah, hey. JK Rowling transphobic, and we are very much against any of that. Anything uh, JK Rowling's throwing out there, so you know what? Trevor the Frog ER, it's like you can still enjoy Harry Potter. You don't enjoy what she's doing. And that's Trevor with the ER. Pay a little bit of homage, but just understand, not liking a lot going on there. Not supporting the really bad things. It's the perfect screw you. Uh, exactly. It's like, that's what I meant the whole time. Frog? You want to name it Frog? Leapfrog? Ooh. Oh, so we're actually is a frog. Yes, it is. Frogger, we could just name this one Frogger, but this is also a toad. Frog, Frog is pretty fire, you're not wrong. Yeah, let's go Frog. There we go, Frog. Okay, let me. Um, And also, I, this is, I, that was actually, ooh, let's see the ability first. Hydration, not great. I think it's a good moment to say something because it's it's not something that can come up in stream often. But I want people to know this is a, a stream, this is a this is a safe place. As long as you are a person that is kind to others, you are very accepted here. I, regardless who you are, what you look like, who you love, anything like that, you are very, very accepted here. And if you're someone who is watching, who does not accept other people, I, you can hit the road or be very quiet about that. Because I make content to hopefully make people happy. There's a lot of people trying to escape the crappiness of the real world. I never want anyone to not feel safe here, not feel included. There's a lot of awful places in the world that make a lot of wonderful people not feel included for being themselves. This is not going to be one of those places. And I understand. I'm a straight white guy. I haven't dealt with any of that. There's a lot I still need to learn, but I'm going to do my best to make everyone feel as inclusive as I can. And if I need to learn more, I'll do my best. So I wanted to say that I don't say it enough. I, but if it comes up naturally, I want to try to say something because I know I know that's very important for a lot of people, and I do apologize if I have not made that clear enough. We'll move past that because it's, you know, it's difficult to make a transition from seriousness to frog, 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 but we're going back to frog, frog, frog. And also, I do want to say there's a lot of really wonderful things being said. 
I'm not saying or doing anything special. I am doing the bare minimum right now. So don't put me on a pedestal. I am doing the bare minimum. I, I'm really hopeful that, you know, saying that can make people know that they feel included. But again, I that's I'm doing so little. I just I just wanted to say something. So with all of that being said, we're back to the frog. Back to the frog fun. Do we know where other frogs can be found? We do indeed. I have a list of other frogs. We are coming up on two more frogs. Well, actually, wait a minute. We are coming up on two more frogs. We polywag is in Cerulean. We don't need to catch two more temples because we're going to go catch two polywags that will turn into a polywrath and then a polytoad. So we could just roll with these guys. Now, it could be nice to get a water absorb temple. How do you get a hidden ability temple? Like, how would I, like, will it tell me if it's hidden ability or what? I don't know how that works. Does anyone remember how Dex Nav works? Hey, New Wave Star, I appreciate it. Thank you very much for the sub. Oh, I mean to do that. But if anyone knows, that would be pretty cool. Um... I feel like getting one hidden ability frog would be nice. Dexnav search level of 10 and up has a 5% chance of hidden ability. Okay, so I feel like I need more money so I can buy more Pokeballs to do that. So we'll do that in the future if we need a water absorb temple. Right now we don't need one. It just could be nice in the future. Colt, thank you so much for the sub. I really, really appreciate you using the prime on me. Hidden ability. That's a good call, Katie. Katie, that's why you're here. I mean, I I can't be going at this alone trying to, you know, really do the Team Frog justice. I mean, if you weren't here, right? If Katie wasn't here, would I be able to use the frog transition and seamlessly go into opening a pack of Yu-Gi-Oh cards that none of us care about unless it has a secret rare frog and there's only one more secret rare in this entire booster box? Meaning if I don't get the, the secret rare frog, I'll have to waste more money to get more cards, but I'm determined to pull the secret rare Yu-Gi-Oh card that is a frog. So you know what? We're going to do it because everyone's super excited. This is what everyone came here for. This is what we want. And here it is. But it's not a secret rare, so we're fine. It's Cyber Angel Frash, and we're fine with it. It's fine. Also, chat, if anyone knows of another, like, set of cards that has, like, a really rare frog in it, uh, let me know, and I will stupidly spend my money to open it on stream. I want I want everyone to know if you can think of an affordable like set of cards that has like rare frogs in it. I will. I will open them. Prime sub lasts a month and then you have to manually re uh, subscribe with Prime. But it lasts a month. We are only catching frogs. We're only catching frogs. We're only using frogs. And if you wonder why we used the ghastly before, because it was a ghost of frogs past. I appreciate you, Meadow. Thank you so much. Rock rough. Nom 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 nom. Okay. Like the Tim pole he killed earlier. I don't. But I. I mean, everyone makes mistakes. Everyone has those days. Like you know, you know how it is. Right? Like everyone. Frank, 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 Frank did it. First battle, first victory. Frank is unstoppable. Wow. No! Rattata! Frank, one more. One more! Attack, little guy. Oh, it's focusing up. It's fine. This is it. This is it. Get the crit. Get the crit it wants. Spit in its face, Frank. That's fine, Frank. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Trevor, this is your moment. There it is, Trevor. There it is, buddy. Put that Rattata in its place and we'll keep on keeping on, little guy. 
We will keep on keeping on. Several people have tried to tell you, but you don't need uh, more Pokeballs to hunt the hidden ability temple. Search level is just encouraging them. The thing will tell you in advance about hidden ability. Oh! Oh, I feel like that was not said as specifically as I wanted. I mean, you said it. I just... Hmm. I missed the other people who said that correctly. Um... I, it's probably worth trying to get a hidden ability frog. I think before we leave, because it's... Yeah, let's, let's go get the hidden ability frog. We will be really happy about it long term. And then I think... And we'll figure out who to bench later. Let's just go get our hidden ability frog. Thank you very much, Sam. I appreciate the heck out of you. Any tips for a hardcore Nuzlocke? Research. Research the like the battles you're going to go against. Like, make sure you have... Like, the one thing you have over the, like, the game is your knowledge of the game, of course. You can know what's coming, even though they might not know what your team is. This is very annoying. Okay, that was very annoying. Okay, I'm not having a good time with this so far. Hey, perfect. All right, there we go. Um. Cool. Okay. Oh, Growl Hydration. Oh, cool. It's giving me more information on them. Mud Shots. We do not need Growl. Supersonic could be clutch if we're like really in a tough spot. Still a horrible move, but what are you going to do? Okay, Snore, Swift, Swim. Okay. I mean, if we see like a really crazy Swift Swimmer, we might as well take it. Like a Swift Swim Pokemon with like an extra, like a crazy move. We can work together, chat. Come on, chat, you guys. Wait. Is this already at its level cap? Oh, that's absurd. We can work together. We can do this. Growl hydration. Nah. Okay. Okay. If you register, if you press R over Pokemon, you can register them in the Dex Nav. Oh, cool. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that, chat. Uh, who said that? Let me... Um, try Zeke. Thank you so much, man. I really, truly appreciate that. I think a few people had said register. I I don't know. Like, you need to tell me the, the controls. I've never played this game before. So I'm sorry if it's, like, infuriating to watch and I don't know everything. I'm just anyone who's playing a game for the first time. Like, I just don't know all of the controls. Mud slap hydration. Mud slap? Why would I care about mud slap? Growl? Growl, Swift Swim? Come on, boo. Have better hidden like a like moves. What's going on here? Snore hydration tease. Boo. 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 Okay. <laughs> hmm. Okie dokie. I'm so sick of Growl Swift Swim. <gasps> Earth Power Hydration. Ooh. That might be worth catching. That might be worth catching. 
Yeah, that's... That is something special. This is Tad? You, you sound so excited to name one of these Tad. I, I refuse to, to not go with that. Tad. Alright. We got a Hydration one with Earth Power. That is unreal. Okay, cool. We can find a Swift Swim with Earth Power. Yes! 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 Oh my god. Wow, this is going incredibly well. This is great. Did someone just say Frongkowski? Jeez, man, we are on top of it with nicknames. Chat, you guys just get it. Frongkowski even like fit? <laughs> oh my god, perfectly. Frongkowski. Wow. That's crazy. All right, now we just need a water absorb one. So let's go heal and we can go uh, get our our uh, water absorb one. We're going to have to box one of these frogs. That's okay. Um who is our worst frog? It's probably Frank, and we just got Frankowski, so it's got to be Frank, and that makes makes sense. Uh, Frank, we're gonna move you here. We need to make this wallpaper, uh, the right wallpaper. River. There we go, buddy. What are we gonna name this? Hmm. Frog. Topia? Hmm. Frog friends. The pond! Oh, I like that. The pond. Short and sweet. I like that. I sometimes just need to keep it simple. I like that. The pond. Look at that. That's beautiful. Look at that. Let's go get let's go get a water absorb frog now. Alright. We're gonna get our frog because we love frogs. We are a frog, 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 frog. I hate you much shop. That's not true, I love you, but I'm upset with what you did. Do 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 do. And we're training up our other frogs while we're doing this. Do 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 do. Do, 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 do. Oh god, that's so far away. Have I lost any Pokemon yet? Not a Nuzlocke. But I've definitely lost. <gasps> Water Absorb! Yes! Finally! There we go! Wow! Okay, it's not a hidden ability, or it's not a uh, earth power hidden ability one, but I think that's fine. I think that still works out. And it's level 20. Wait, it's above the level cap? We're still going to catch it, but that's a little bizarre. Above the level cap, jeez. This is the strongest temple the world's ever seen. Hey, I'll take it. Sure. There you go, Frog. Tad. What are we naming this? Name it Friddle? Tim the Bull Man. It's not even fit. <laughs> Tim. Oh my god, I think it fits. Wait. Tim Whole Man. That's absurd. This is so silly. This is absurdly silly. Fine with it. Fine with it. Here for it. 
All right, come on. We got Trevor, Frog, Tad, Frogkowski, Tim, the Pole Man. Who's going to beat this team of frogs? Nobody. Zero people are defeating this squad. Let me tell you. Wow. Wow, let's... uh. I mean, we can keep training up the the frogs. Let's let's go heal, and we'll just keep training. He's friends with Mike Evans. It's I'm very jealous. I'm gonna be honest. Very very jealous. I probably should stop doing this soon so I can go eat dinner. But chat, this has been one of the most fun streams I, I've ever done, and I don't know if I can stream this tomorrow, chat. I have to pick up my mom and my stepdad from the airport, and as much as I love streaming and frogs, I my my mother is is a wonderful wonderful person, and doing her a favor is more important than streaming. But Wednesday, <laughs> and maybe hey, maybe tomorrow I do a late stream. Maybe I still sneak in a later stream. But I am really excited to continue with this stream or with this series. I'm gonna be honest, Katie. Nikki's like her fiasco at the airport has me significantly more worried than I've ever been about picking someone up in the airport. I have no idea what she could have possibly done. And chat, a lot of people ask me like what my um what my schedule is for streaming. It just re realistically, like right now, my fiance, who is a doctor, is in the middle of a rotation. She's in residency right now, and she's in a rotation where she's working 79 hours a week. So my schedule is very dependent on my ability to get other work done. And still try to keep the house somewhat in order and take care of the puppy and myself and everything. But right now, it is really difficult to to do everything that I, I want to do. So I'll try to stream around 2 or 3 uh, p.m. Eastern Standard Time every day, Monday through Friday. But this month is really tough. And above any everything else, I need to try to keep day or uh, weekly uploads on Pokemon Seven Plays. I want to keep streaming. I want to keep getting the vods up. I want to keep getting random Pokemon Seven videos up. But right now, it's really difficult to to handle everything. So I'm sorry I can't give you guys like a a more uh, set in stone schedule. But I really appreciate everyone who comes out to the streams. It it's very very appreciated. Ooh, this is pretty interesting. I don't think any of our Pokemon now really are going to use it, but when we get a Poliwrath, it'll be pretty cool. What's the other nurse do for you? She can help change your um, natures, which is very cool. Okay. There's a Raid Den coming up. There is a Raid Den! Yes! This worked perfectly for me last time. I'm going to do it again. Oh, you? Frankowski and Tad. Easy. Roly Coley. Yes. Large Frog! <laughs> there we go. This is what you love to see. This is why I do this. <laughs> For the love of the frog. Ooh, that's some big damage right there. All right, that's going to heal up the roly coly, which is a little frustrating, but. Hey, you found a shiny Machop playing Radical Red. Congrats. Oh, that is so exciting. I absolutely love Machop. One of my favorite Pokemon. Oh, that's so cool. Congrats on that. Oh, I'm very happy to hear that. All right, roly coly. I'm gonna need you to go down. I'm gonna do a ton of damage here, right? Uh, then it's gonna, yeah, it's gonna have that. All right, cool, you broke that. And then I think we kill this turn. I think we should kill this turn. Perfect, there we go. That's what I like to see. Buh bye, Roly Coley. I'm not gonna catch you. You are not a frog. 
sure. We can sell those. Cool. Okay. That would have been so helpful for Brock, but whatever. Moonstone sick. I'll take it. All right. Awesome. We do not have Rock Smash. Do, did I get Rock Smash and I didn't notice? That's like, I guess, always a possibility. I did not. All right. Cool. Here, I don't know why you're bothering me, but I want you to stop. I'm going to be honest. Aqua Ring. Ooh, Aqua Ring could be helpful. I think over Supersonic, which is just a bad move. Yeah, we'll just do that for all of these. Noibat. We outspeed. Dead. Cool. Rock Rough. Outspeed. Ooh, not dead, but dead now. That's where Terrakion is? That's absurd. All right, well... It'll track you on eventually, but also... Frongkowski! No. Frongkowski. Frongkowski. Yeah. Perfect. Sure, Frank. Ooh. Well, wait. Why would I ever want Mudshot? Oh, because you can lower speed. I don't think this guy learns Aqua Ring. Okay, cool. Sure, you can... Nope, not you either. Oh, okay, that's fine. Boom, there you go, Franky. There you go, Franky Wonky. Okay, I mean, I guess we can keep the... Nah, we'll just keep you in front for now, just to make it easier. There's no reason not to just decimate these trainers. This is a very easy part of the game, and hey, we will take the easy parts of the game when we get them, because it is not an easy game. We've already had some sad moments, so if I can destroy a few gym or a few trainers, why not? Why not us? If we can beat up a very silly snake, I'll do it. And someone also said there's like a big battle coming up, which is scary. So I, I'm kind of... I'm a little nervous. I'd like to get there and just kind of see what I'm up against. Because right now, beating up Rattata's not, you know, too worrying, if we're going to be honest. Uh, Fronkowski, you've never let me down. You haven't had too many moments yet, but you haven't let me down in those few moments, so... I'll take it. Ooh, low sweep's kind of cool. Wait. Let's see. Well, first, no, they they don't learn, John. No one learns. Okay, that's stupid. All right, let's keep going. Just keep going. Ignore it. Ignore it. Hello, nerd. I'm gonna beat you up because I have frogs. Trevor, do the thing, Trevor. Do the thing. There we go. Okay. Do the thing again. Let's keep doing it. That was embarrassing. We don't talk about that. Chat, no one bring that up. We just didn't happen. None of those things happens. If I don't take the Helix Fossil, people are going to upset me. Uh, so I'm just going to take the Helix Fossil and just accept it. This is what we're doing. Um, Frogosaur, you're going to be in front. I assume we have a big battle. Here it is. Are you the twerp messing with my grunts? Little kid, you think you're brave? Hey, I'll teach you a valuable lesson. All right, that's fine. Last time there was a big battle in front of us. We didn't have a full team of frogs. We had one frog and a ghostly army. Today I stand before Archer with frogs on frogs on frogs. And this fool sends out a fairy demon fake out all you want it's the last thing you'll ever do thunder wave all you want it's the last thing you'll ever do <laughs> i only lied once okay what's next hound door that's fine that's fine we have an army of tadpoles we'll bring in tim the pole man because tim the pole man won't listen to me and it's a great thing to sacrifice here. Perfect. Incinerate. Do whatever you want. Tim the Pool Man. Maybe will listen. Probably not. It listened, Tim. Thank you. 
Oh, this is great. Is that Hidden Power Grass? Because that is absurd. Are you kidding me? Why, Houndor? Why do you hate frogs so much? Oh. Terrified of Tim and its power. That's fine. That's fine. Mud shot to slow it down. Mud shot to slow it down. Don't see a reason not to. Perfect. Howl. You can howl at the moon all you want, Mighty And I'm just going to keep lowering your speed, making sure that no matter what you do, all my Pokemon outspeed you. That's fine. That's fine. Yep, yep, yep. That's do whatever you got to do. That's fine. Going to keep making you slower. That's fine. Set up all you want. Does Mob Bomb affect accuracy? Doesn't matter. Bite? Okay. <sighs> Frunkowski! You've never let me down before. Earth power. Might not kill, but that does a good chunk. That does a good chunk. Goodbye, Frunkowski. Welcome in, Frog. Bubble beam. B bye, Mighty Enna. I won't miss you. You guys said I couldn't beat Archer with a team of frogs. Come on. Where's your faith in Team Frog? Where's your faith in Team Frog? Easy. Sometimes it's too easy for us. Yeah, sit back, relax, and just watch Team Frog go to work. It's too easy. Way too easy. Boom. There we go, Frog. The Rogue Frog. That was a blunder. Huh? Sure, do whatever you want, man. I don't care. Frogman answers to no one. No evil organization. No good organization. Frogman is its own frog. You know what? You guys are the punchy twins. Thank you so much. Why did you give me those? Oh my god, give me things, please. Yes. Power up punch? Wait, what? When one of our Pokemon can learn that? Oh my god, we are in business. Okay. Raspberry. Cool. Okay. Roar's pretty good if they're setting up. Having something to, to phase things out will be very helpful, that's for sure. What's in this grass? I'm just interested in what's in this grass at this point. I know we have Poliwag coming up. I don't think it's here, but... No, I know it's not here, but it's always nice to see what's here, at least. I don't know, maybe we find a shiny, right? Who knows? Who is this explorer? Ah, oh, I thought he was gonna give me thief. Okay, chat. This has been a very, very fun stream. Let me see if anyone in here gives us anything. Okay. That's fine. I think this is a perfect place to end this stream because next time we have some polywags to catch, which is very exciting and a brand new gym to go against. So I want to save the polywag for next time. So we're still catching new frogs and having fun, but this has been a lot of fun and I truly cannot wait for the next frog stream, guys.